All right, here's some quick tips uh, for having a faster, funner, fistful of lead game. One of the things that comes up is people having trouble keeping track of which one of their characters have activated or not. One of the tricks I use is I have cards that have a picture of the character on one side and their information on the back. So after that character who is right here activates, I can flip this over and I know he's gone. Now, and that also leaves me with <clears throat> all the info here on the back. Now, you may not have a card like that. You have a card with the uh, characters on the front and no information. So what you can do is once the character activates, simply turn it on its side. This works great because uh, if you're like me, I like to keep all of my uh, shock and wounds on the card, help me remember uh, rather than have it on the table and add to the clutter. Tip number two, when you're attacking, go ahead and roll your attack dice and your wound dice at the same time. The speed stuff up greatly. So all you have to do is have two different color of dice. Let's say the black is the attack and the white is my result. If you hit, like let's say I was firing at long range, there's my wound roll right there, quick and easy. Same way when you're uh, doing close combat, you can just say, have your attack dice and here's what would happen. Of course, if you miss, then you just ignore the second wound dice. You'd be surprised how much time this saves. All right, third quick tip. So let's say uh, you've got four players that all ended up with the same card. Now, rather than going through the tiebreakers by suit, uh, you can look and see, all right, let's say both of these players are on the same side. Just have them go at the same time. Or let's say these players uh, are so far apart that they're really not gonna interfere with each other. Go ahead and have them go at the same time. This will speed things up greatly uh, especially when you have lots of players like I do on a regular basis.